Hi guys, thanks for uh, coming uh, to watch my video. Uh, today I'm going to do um, a... First off, I'm going to take this one off. The uh, thing I made yesterday, the geode. Uh, I'm not sure how you pronounce it, but here in Holland it's really geode. And there was someone that asked me to pronounce two words. That was giraffe, that we call that a giraffe. And they asked for, let me think, it was something like ge geology, geology, that's what we say, that's the Dutch pronounce, the way we pronounce it, uh, geology, so that's about it. So um, first off I gotta get my hair up because I can't work with all the hair in my face, so here we go. It's better it looks like I just do it like that in a flash well um, I just washed my hair and uh, it's all over the place so um, I have to uh, put it up now I'll be uh, right back and we're going to already have my paint clothes on I'm gonna do the uh, geode release and then we're gonna do some uh, pouring and I had a few questions from my viewers that emailed me so I will uh, try to uh, answer them too. It's really funny doing a video because um, I have my monitor up there so I want to look at my monitor but I also have this little eye on my iPad that I know that I should be looking into the eye so that I'm looking at you guys but I'll get used to it. So see you in a flash. Okay here we're back gloved up and all. And this is the uh, the thing I made yesterday, the geode. And um, it was really easy to take it off because it just released from the silicone. See that? Maybe here a little bit. Here it's a little stuck on. But we can take that off too. There we go. That's the back. This is the front. And it has some sharp, little sharp edges might want to see what we can do with that right now I'm thinking I'll just torch it maybe it'll just melt something like that who knows but this is what it turned into and as you can see if you can see the light see that this is transparent which I was going for because I have all these little crystals in there so all the uh, all around the edge it's transparent and uh, then in the middle comes out the colors I think it's pretty cute. Only what I don't like is these uh, little sharp edges. So let me see what I can do with that, with those. Uh, some I want to find something really sharp. That's pretty sharp. Let's see what that does. Nope, that doesn't help. It doesn't melt it. It does turn it a little bit brown though. So we don't want to do that. But um. I'm not sure how we can, uh, well, I don't think it's too bad. If you're going to hang it up in front of a window, it's okay. I'll show you that in a bit, the uh, the window thing. Yeah, but look at that sparkle. It is beautiful and really nice and shiny. So a lot of sparkle in it. <coughs> okay, so here's the mold. And like someone said, I don't think you're going to get that silicone off the mat. Well, I'm pretty happy it didn't come off the mat because now I still have a mold and I can do another one. But as you can see, uh, the resin really is easy to take off uh, the mat, so that's good. See everything where it dripped off? I can just peel it off. And then here in the middle, see how you can just take it out? That is amazing, isn't it? There it goes. See that? And even there you can see the holographic glitter in there and maybe you know if you like uh, to have it um, without the hole in the middle you could just pour in a transparent uh, resin here but I sort of like how it is like this I like the hole in the middle but we can use this as many times as we want and you can even build it up a little bit better or whatever you want to do with it and um, I'm, I'm going to be ordering more resin because I'm low at the moment. I'm down to my last, I think, 
400 milliliters so I'll be ordering some uh, some new resin but I do like to use this one, Mastercast, because guys, I'm telling you, this is the only one that doesn't really, you know, get my eyes watery. And there's no reaction to my lungs whatsoever that I find, you know, sometimes it prickles in your lungs. And I don't like that. So, okay, this one's ready for the next uh, pour. And I'm going to show you the geode in front of a window in a bit. Now, put this away. Now this is the uh, the discount code. It's still the same code, and they are going to expand the colors that they have on the website. So um, you're going to be uh, coming in there like new customers, and they're going to be doing a lot of um, adding of colors. And uh, if you like, you can even uh, email them. I'm pretty sure they would love to hear uh, about you know what you guys think of the website. Because that always helps someone, you know, when you're starting a, a new web shop or something, sometimes you just wish you could talk to the customers that just came in, you know, the first ones, to ask them about how your website looks, if there's something you want them to, you want to, to add or something like that. But this is it, it's Patty's Pigments, and if you go to this link, you click on the Patty's Pigments, then you have to click on it again and again, and I know some said, the site is down but it's really not I don't know what's going on maybe you try a different browser because every time I read that the site was down I went over and I just you know automatically got in there so maybe you'll have to try that and maybe it's good to send them an email about it because uh, I'm sure they would really like to know if the site is down now um, what I promised yesterday and that's what I'm gonna do in a bit First, I'm going to stop this video and then um, do the window thing and then I'm going to pour. But I'm going to start pouring. My first pour is not going to be on this one, but it's going to be on this because I'm really, really excited about how these slits are placed. Because some are higher and some are lower, so that's what, something I'd like to test. Now, I've had a question on uh, the YouTube channel where to buy this. But people, I know a lot of people ask me where I buy stuff, but unless you live in, in Holland or in Europe, by that matter, um, you, you know, I, I don't know where you buy this kind of stuff in America or Canada or Australia. So if you live in Europe, please let me know and I might be able to send you one of these. I'm not sure if the shop still has them, but they are pretty cheap, like two bucks. So uh, that's it. Okay, so I'll be right back. Thank you all for watching this little uh, Geoda unveiling. And I will be right back with a beautiful pour. Thanks for watching. Love you all to pieces.